Hey everybody, I got another toy review. This time I have this polar bear rescue playset from Animal Planet. I picked this up at, at my local Toys R Us the other day. This set includes Mother Polar Bear and her cub, one action figure with his accessories, two scary wolves, a fish, and a snowmobile for him to ride on. So let's get this out of the package and see what it's all about. Okay, so we got everything out of the package here, and let's take a look at it. Let's start out with the, the little bear cub. He's very small, looks very realistic, you know, he's very cute. You know, he doesn't have any moving parts. He's just all one solid piece, but it's nicely painted. Um, and then we got the mother bear, and uh, you know, she's got a lot of articulation. Both her, all four of her legs move. Um, she also has an action where if you press the button on top, you know, she does like a swiping action like she's coming to defend her baby. You know, if the wolves are coming at her or if you have other things coming at her. Um, you know, her head moves up and down. <clears throat> uh, the mouth doesn't open. Um, she does, she can stand up all like this and then you can move her head down. So it does look like she's standing up. And you can get it to stand up on its own. You know, it takes a little bit. You can get it set up a little bit like that. You know, so it looks like she's standing up ready to attack. <clears throat> and then we got a small little fish that comes with it. It looks like a small little salmon. You know, it's just more for display. You can put it in, you know, it looks like maybe the mom is trying to feed the baby. You can kind of put it in her mouth. You know, and then we got the wolves here. You know, this one's gray. It's got some pretty scary teeth. Uh, let's see if we can get it focused in there. And, you know, he's got some gray paint on him. He's all white. Then we got the other one here. He's mostly brown, similar painting, half half brown, half white, same painted in teeth. And then we got the little medical kit here. You know, it opens up and it's like a small little box. You can put all these little accessories in it. You know, he's got a little thermos here with a little medical thing on it. He's got a stethoscope for helping if the the bear is injured or something. You know, he's out there trying to help him out. Some little pliers. Here's a little syringe in case he's got to give him medicine or a shot. Some scissors. Uh, looks like a small little knife or a scalpel. Some tweezers. And a small little hammer, you know, for checking like reflexes or you know, working on something out there. And then you can put the little lid on, and then you open the handle, sits just like that. <clears throat> Let's set the bear down a little bit. Move her head up so you can see it better. And then we'll move on to the uh, snowmobile. Move this over to the side a little bit. And let's take a look at the uh, action figure. And he's a pretty basic Animal Planet figure. Uh, he looks kind of like a uh, you know, he's like a archaeologist or he's like a, you know, he's like a hiker or an adventurer and he's, you know, out in the, uh, Antarctica or something. He's got some fish hanging here. He's got little canteen accessory. Um, you know, his arms can do a 360 both. Uh, you know, he's got a little gun pouch over here on the side. His arms, his legs do move up and down. So you can get him into seating positions so that he can be standing or, you know, he can go in the snowmobile. Um, you know, you can stick him right in. And it looks like he's driving the snowmobile. And, uh, you know, also, we'll take a look at the snowmobile. <clears throat> uh, right on the side it says, like, Animal Planet. Um, it does have wheels in the front and in the back. So it does roll around pretty well. Um, it's got this little caged in area in the back. 
and uh, you know it can fit this little uh, pack back here, so you can take it. He can take it with him when he's going. <clears throat> and uh, it's got a little hitch, so in some other the play sets that you can pick up from a uh, Animal Planet or something, you know, sometimes they have trailers that you can put them on. And uh, that's basically it for the set. It seems pretty nice. Uh, the mother bear is very well articulated. Seems like a lot of fun for a lot of kids and different people. Um, and uh, we'll stop it right there and then we're going to come right back. Okay, so we got our little adventure set out here. And our little adventure guy, he's out fishing. And he's just hanging out by the water. He's got his little cave set up. And then, you know, all of a sudden, little baby bear comes in. And he's all sitting there and he's looking at the fish and, you know, the uh, adventure guy, he's feeling sorry for the little bear because the little bear looks hungry. So he goes in and he tries to give the fish to him. <clears throat> hey, little guy, I bet you want some fish, don't you? And he throws the fish over to him. And then he comes over and he puts down his fishing pole. And then he comes over like this and he's trying to be all nice to the baby bear and he's all talking to him, hey little guy what are you doing where's your mom at and he's just hanging out and he's talking to him and he's like oh he seems so alone what are you doing out here Then all of a sudden, he starts to hear a noise, and he's like, oh, he hears footsteps, and it sounds really big, and he's like, oh my god, what is that? Uh-oh, that must be the mother bear coming. Uh-oh, uh-oh, here she comes. Uh-oh, oh, he doesn't like her being by his baby. Oh my god. Ooh, and then he took a swipe at him. Uh oh. Ooh, all of a sudden he runs over and then he grabs the torch and he's trying to keep the bear away. Uh oh. And he's like. Trying to wave the bear away, and she's like all swiping at him. And he's getting all scared, so he runs back to his hut. And then she runs over there. And he's like, oh no, I gotta get out of here. So he runs over to his snowmobile, and he jumps in. He's like, I gotta get out of here. So then the mother bear starts to go over. And he's trying to get the snowmobile going, but it won't start. And he's trying to get it going, and she's getting closer and closer, and she was pretty mad. Oh, oh, he's got it going now. Whoa. Whoa, he's getting out of there. <clears throat> so now our adventure guy, he got away, you know, and he's on his way back home. Then all of a sudden the mother bear is back with her baby. And then they're all just, she's trying to show him how to eat the fish. And, you know, they're just hanging out. And, you know, everything seems all right. And then all of a sudden. Uh-oh. All of a sudden, whoa, what is that? And the mother bear gets all worried. Uh-oh. Look, here comes a wolf, and then the other one, oh no, 
And they're going after the baby bear. So now the wolves are back. And then the mother bear, she's trying to defend him. But now, oh no. Oh, the wolves, they're coming at her. Oh no, the wolves are biting at her and they're starting to attack her. Oh no, they're coming from over here. What are they gonna do? The mother bear, she's all getting attacked. Oh, so now she's getting attacked again. What is the mother bear and the baby bear gonna do? What was that? Something coming out of nowhere. Uh oh. So all of a sudden there's just more ice balls coming. Where are they coming from? Uh oh. All of a sudden. Uh oh. What's that noise? Oh, he's coming in. What is it? Oh. It's the giant Yeti. Oh. And he's stomping on him. And then he comes over to the other, the other wolf. And he punches him away. He picks him up. So now the wolves are all running away. And the mother bear turns. And she sees what happened. So now the mother bear, she sees that the Yeti, he was there to help him to get rid of the wolves. So she turns around and she sees their babies all right. And her and her baby run off and they live happily ever after. And then the Yeti, he goes back into his cave where he belongs. The end.